You know, if you were more honest with folk, you mightn't be in this mess. Hey? Have you read this book? Step one. Honesty sows the seeds of happiness. You're a good man, Rich. You're just full of shit. Had a really nice night and then he invited me back to his and he said I was the first, first date that he's ever invited back. So I was like, ooh. Did you, um, you know? Well, yeah. When are you seeing him again? I don't know because he didn't text me at the weekend. So I text him on Saturday and then I text him on Sunday afternoon and then I've texted him this morning so we'll wait and see. What's all this, girls? Um, Janine was just saying that she thought Eric was quite nice. Janine, we'll have none of that, thank you. That's you told. Between me and you, mm. she had a thing going a few years back with Eric. Obviously, while she was still married. <gasps> I mean, I did go out with an older guy once. Mm. I got this really strange message. And it said he was going back to his wife and kids. Didn't even know he'd got a wife and kids. Wow. What love of my life he were, Becky. Mm. I went out with an older guy once. I was like 23, he was like 33. For like three weeks and then, I don't know, he just didn't call or text me back. I left him like 14 voice messages as well. So after that, I just left it. That's awful, that Becky. Mm. I think he's dead, dear. Gosh, I've never even thought about that. Okay. I understand. Can you just give me that name again, please? Thank you. I've just been informed. The situation has now changed. This is now a murder investigation. And I know you were there. It's not true. Verity, in my experience, it's the forensic evidence that convicts arsonists. You need to tell me what you did that night. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Nicola Cage!